oh my gosh you guys this is ending up being so cute so let me just go ahead and show you hi guys happy spring and Easter is around the corner. So I decided that I'm just going to be doing some fun machine embroidery project ideas for you. This particular project is gonna be good for beginners. I'm going to show you how to machine embroider tea towels. I've printed the image that I want to embroider on my tea towel. And now I am just using a cutaway or I'm sorry, this is a tearaway stabilizer that I picked up from Amazon. So I'm just gonna cut a couple of pieces and I'm using my five by seven hoop and I picked up these uh, flower sack towels off of Amazon for fairly cheap. I got 14 of them. I believe it was $19. I can't really remember, but I'm going to try these out. I haven't tried them out yet. So I'm just going to lightly iron them and then I thought of something and I don't know if this is going to exactly work and then I'm just going to mark my middle and what I'm doing right now is I'm spraying the inside and then I'm folding it down uh, okay let me see if I had a flatter surface that would work but I'm going to stitch on two layers of this towel just to make it a little bit more stable. I'm not sure if I'm explaining that correctly, but you'll see right here. I'm just going to see how I got it doubled up and I'm just going to spray this down to my hoop and stitch over two layers of the towel. Okay, so I think it turned out great. So if you saw what I did, just to give it a little bit more um, heaviness, you know, stiffness, I folded it in the back and stitched that too. See, so it's stitched together just to make it be a little bit more stable, but I think that is fine. And then you just fold it up like this and I love it. This particular embroidery design can be purchased at designsbyjuju.com and they have beautiful embroidery files for really cheap. They always have sales, so definitely check them out. Okay, so now I'm on a roll. I'm going to get going with another hand towel because while I was stitching this, I came up with another idea. You may have already seen me stitch out this bunny, but I think it's the cutest thing ever. I did stitch it out in a previous video. This is a design that I bought off of Etsy, but just the bunny only. And then I added my own words to it through my Embrilliance software.
guys, look at how cute that is. Every bunny was kung fu fighting. So, uh, sorry, it keeps shining in on me. Every bunny was kung fu fighting. I love that. And so now you have that song in your mind. But here's another thing. I... I have more ideas. I want to do another tea towel. I'm thinking, help me think of some bunny songs. So I'm thinking, I want to dance with some bunny, with some bunny who loves me. Let me know, leave me a comment. Let me know who sings that song. Um, now, well, I know who sings it, so I want to know if you know who sings it. And so I do have another idea, and it came from one of my Instagram followers. So I am going to stitch another one up, and this next one you guys are going to love. So stick with me until the very end because it's a surprise. Sorry, guys, before I move into the next project, I really need to clean up. I'm trying to be better about staying organized. But if you are enjoying this video so far, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button and keep watching. Thank you. you guys this is ending up being so cute so let me just go ahead and show you right here this is what it looks like let's pop this off I'm going to clean it up and get some really good pictures for you guys okay Okay, so I really hope that you enjoyed these embroidery projects and you subscribe and you come back next week for some more uh, embroidery projects and also sewing as well. So until next time, happy stitching and sewing. Bye guys.